Let me ask you a question. If you are a podcaster in this moment, how much are you doing post-production? Are you writing articles, summaries, giving interesting different titles, writing YouTube descriptions? Are you writing newsletters? If you're not doing all of them, that's okay. Because as a podcaster for over 10 years, I know that's just a lot of work. Typically 10 years ago or even five years ago, you would need multiple interns or virtual assistants who specialize in different skill sets. On top of that, it's really hard to organize all these assets. Well, today I wanna to introduce you to Swell AI. I have been following Swell and using this particular tool for over a year now. We have previously published a blog post as well, which I'm gonna list in the description below. Please check it out. Swell AI is an AI tool and a platform that transforms your audio or video into clips, summaries, articles, newsletters, social posts, and on top of that, it helps you schedule them out automatically too. If it sounds too good to be true, take a look at my screen. So as you can see on my screen, it allows you to connect to multiple platforms and services you are already using, where you're saving your episodes, such as Google Drive or Dropbox, or even better, if you are like me, who's live streaming directly to a platform such as YouTube, you can simply drop that YouTube link and uh, Swell AI will process all that content for you. Once it's done, now you can view your content and jump right into all the assets that are readily available to you. So on the left-hand side of the screen, as you can see, you'll have transcript, clips, uh, clip exports. If you wanna export all of them together, you have a chat as well as chat in bed. I'm gonna talk about that in just a second. You have all the documents as mentioned earlier in this video, such as, you know, perfect socials, ultimate show notes, titles, articles, summary, timestamps, and you can even create from a template. If you're not happy with the list of documents or for your particular show, you want something extra. One of my favorite podcasters, Jordan Harbinger, actually prepare things like cheat sheets and notes at the top of his show notes page for people so you can create something on your own that is custom made directly within Swell AI and save it there. One of my favorite AI features from Swell, surprisingly, is the chatbot. After Swell has processed your single episode, and for us, a lot of our episodes are at least 30 minute long, oftentimes it's one hour to 90 minutes, and there's just a lot of information packed into a single recording. Now I can use Swell AI's chatbot to ask questions directly based off of the content that I recorded with my guests. I find that to be really insightful because sometimes for us as creators, we're so immersed in the recording process, it's not always easy for us to recall every bit of the detail. What I also love about the chatbot process is I can see myself through the eyes of a listener and somebody who follows the show. Now I think about the questions I will ask, and I'm curious to see the answers it provides as a result of the content and context of my episode. As a result, I can see many other types of content I can create as well, such as quick Q&A or even FAQs from a single episode. Swell allows you to brand your chatbot as well as your clips based on your brand assets or brand colors. I wanna say a few more things about their AI clip feature which means that you can automatically get your clips from a single episode. You can also specify the duration. It's over or under a minute or 30 seconds. In addition to automatic AI clips, you can also manually create your clips directly from within the Swell platform. Last but not least, I do wanna mention pricing real quick for Swell. It is quite affordable, which I like. So to get started, you can try Swell completely free of charge and that allows you to upload one episode just to feel it out. Now, if you're an individual creator like us, and there is the next tier up at $29 a month and up to 300 minutes. And I think that's perfect for people who are releasing, let's say one episode a week, you know, up to about 60 minutes or so. If you're an agency, if you're helping other people running their podcasts, or if you yourself are running more than one podcast, you can consider the agency model, which allows you to upload up to 600 minutes. If you don't want to commit to a subscription, I know a lot of people don't like the idea of subscriptions, you know, pay and forget it. Instead, if you want something called pay on the go, they have an option for you as well. Whether it's Swell AI or any other AI platform, I strongly believe that we as humans creators need to be in the loop. There's no exception. What I love about AI is leveraging them as a partner, as an assistant, 
and I know I'm still in charge. That means I review them or I invite my virtual assistant or my content manager to review them. And then we instill our unique content. Not only that, I really like to preserve the tone and the voice of Face World as a brand where we stay conversational. We are really trying not to sensationalize the idea of the creative process and really jazz it up. We don't want to exaggerate or be inauthentic. So please let me know what you think. Look forward to hearing from you and I'm gonna see you in the next video.